I love your body and your soul. But we'll be a call to your show. My name is Bolanti Amosha. I'm going to call me Mr. Lazar. Ah! You crap! The title of the movie that we are shooting now is sent off. Oh, damn it. This movie is a bit challenging. Can you listen to yourself? The major thing about this concept is that if you know you love your husband, you love your wife, stay with your wife. Take your phone and confirm the money. Shut up, shut up, shut up. For your information, we are charging you to court. You need to suspect you, sir. If you don't want to go, you don't want to go. 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 Okay, my name is Odun Nadia I love everyone of you. Thank you so much for your support. That's why this is a fantastic movie that we're doing now. Yeah, sent off by Alaji Waidi Igadwani. Please try and watch this movie anytime you can. Thank you so much. My name is Bolaji Amosha. I'm called the Mr. Nadia. I'm an actor, comedian, and filmmaker. I'm here on set of the set of as written and produced by Joshua Jubaya Igadwani. So, sir, uh, the viewers would like to know your biggest challenge. Hello, you know, um, all uh, actors, all filmmakers have different perspectives. They have different opinions, they have different way of doing their movies. This movie is a bit challenging because it's a movie that happens every day. So, the, the, the character I play is a character that happens in every home and I have to do it rightly otherwise I'm going to bother you so everybody has to call his own, our own family the happening, is, the happening in the family is what I'm portraying so if I'm acting it rightly people say oh yes this is actually how it's happening in my family if I'm doing it wrong they don't know you don't get it right so what I want to imply out all the filmmakers that we have a lot of things happening in society today you know speak it one after the other so that when you Showing the movie, who is the old? Just the part of the movie. Thank you very much, sir. I would also like to know what motivates Mr. Lazar. I know Mr. Lazar is today. I know he just started from the grass. He was really hurt. What motivates you? Why is that? Have you always thought about it? Why? It's a touch. Every time I spoke to you, I never intend to be an actor. I turn to be a sportsman because I have a whole model in front of me. Check what they've done. Yeah, because of this. He said, go on. He said, so I'm one of his fanatical fans. So I love to be a footballer. But unfortunately for me, whenever I <coughs> play football, I got injured. So along the line, I met a friend of mine who was a doctor. The doctor today, I just got into the industry. I don't know that that is real. That's going to be great. My real profession. Sir, sorry, the last question before we leave, because we know you're very busy. Aside from acting, as you guys acting, what other business do you have? So we ask this question times down about the various parts of the creation. As for now, it's probably catering, probably all like you, probably all other stuff of profession. Aside from acting, what other? Well, aside from acting, presently I'm not doing anything. I do you know, 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 Mr. Latin, we're proud to have you in this morning. Hello, my people. I'm still your boy, Toby. And you're still watching Heaven's TV. This is one of the very best prestigious director and producer I've ever met, Wahid Chagrade. He is a man of great integrity. He's encouraged a lot of young coming actors. And to be sincerely speaking, sir, we want to know what, I mean, how did the whole Wahidi Jagradi as a brand, how did it come up? What is the secret, what's the secret behind the brand? Yeah, thank you very much. Wahidi Jagradi, I've been in the industry for the past 14 years. Yeah, I said 14 years. Thank God. Yeah, the 
only secret is just the wisdom of God. Wisdom from God. So, and we are trying to make sure we portray ourselves in a good manner and to respect us in the society. And thank God we have we have good name and people who say good things about us. You've heard that from Daddy. Well, there's another question the viewers are trying to ask. Because we know you're a very busy director, a very busy man. Yes. How do you tend to manage home with set, being on set? Because you're always on set every now and then. You hardly have time to rest. How do you tend to manage that? How do you balance that equation? Yeah, uh, we thank God. The only thing that we normally pray to God is to give us our partner as a wife. Once you have your wife, a good partner to you, a wife like a mother, she will surely understand this picture of things. So you manage the family. God be the glory, the hotel, and another. We are here, and that's why we say, He that finds a good wife, find it, but find it blessing, find it a good thing. So, sir, we also want to know what are the greatest, or what is the greatest challenge you've ever faced in the industry, in the good industry? There are a lot. First and foremost, let me talk of money. If I'm saying money, if you have a good story that you want to produce, and you don't have anybody to support you. This is a great challenge. I have more than three scripts that I've been keeping with myself for the past, let me say, five, six years now. For instance, for the past six years, I've never shot any movie. Yeah, and this is the one I'm shooting this time now. So, mm, when you have that problem, it's a great challenge. And another thing is, what we are experiencing, what we are experiencing outside within our people. Those people that we want, we expect them to, to appreciate us, some of them will be asking for money. Money from us. That we are still struggling. Most of them don't, don't know that we are still struggling. But thank God we are trying to manage everything. All these challenges are what yeah, yeah, to what makes us a man. And we thank God for everything today. So thank the Lord. Now there's this popular phenomenon about Nollywood Yoruba that they usually don't export the products, that's the movies, to other countries, whereby maybe they, they, they hacked with other countries. And, you know, I, I want to know, sir, in the next five years, where do you tend to see Nollywood Yoruba in the next five years? Uh, I tend to see Nollywood Yoruba in, in a high esteem in the next five years. Yeah, nobody will see a good thing that will not appreciate it. But it's only because we are, we are coming up, we are moving up gradually. And I believe before that five years, uh, Nollywood Yoruba will be, will be exporting outside the country to all other neighboring countries, uh, Western world in general. By the grace of God, and I pray uh, I should be among of those people that will enjoy that dividend when it comes. There's this other question we would like to ask you, sir, Mr. But um, we all know that movie production is not a small thing. Yes. Likewise, um, act. Because you do the both. You must yes. touch, you act, and you produce. It's a very, very great talent that anybody can ever have. Trust me. But the point is that aside from acting and directing and producing, what would you rather do if you weren't acting or directing or producing? If you weren't an actor, if you weren't in the, in the movie industry, what other things would you have probably done? Yeah. As far as I'm concerned, I would like to do business. Buy and sell it. Because I like traveling a lot. I like relating with people. So if I'm not into the movie industry or into acting, producing, directing, I would prefer to be in business life. Buying and selling. And traveling all around. Yes. Just to watch Pebbles TV Dropbox. And here with my Mr. Wai and Chiglade. Sir, we want to know what, what was the first thing you acted in or you probably did? Ah, if <laughs> you want to ask for the first film I had, then ah, that, that, that would be long, but I still remember uh, the TV uh, special program that we do at that time. We bought the title of the film, Talon. Talon. We started with it. So before we go into home video. So probably then I was still a very young know, boy. I, I can't really say, I can't really say. <laughs> All right, Thank God, it's, it's been a long time. Um, we are we are on the set of set black line now. 
that's the theme for that show. Send off. Send off. So yes. send off. Now, sir, the viewers at home would like to know how did the whole motivation about this film come to place? Then, what is the story like? Like, how does it inspire the girl? Yeah, we thank God for everything. You know, as I told you at the, at the beginning of this interview, that everything belongs to God. Wisdom is only God that has. So uh, we have to know that. Uh, the title of the movie that uh, we are shooting now is Send Off. Send off. Uh, we should people call Send Forth. Then in Yoruba language, we call it Idagbeli. Yes. Like, if like someone he, is. Like uh, yeah, yeah, well, yeah, welfare. Let me say welfare. So if you. Uh, what we package in that movie, it does. It's you know, very educative. In which I would, I would like husband and wife to watch it. It has many things to do with husband and wife. Loyalty between two partners. And don't ever emulate people. Because most things that someone would do, go scoffing, you may do it once and, and, and it get a problem. Mm -hmm. So that is why. And people know me that if I want to do a story, I should be able to pass a message to every household that are watching the movie. Which I did in this send off we are talking about. It's coming out very soon. And we have the likes of Odulade Adekola, Mr. Lati, Abolaji Amoso, Jaye Kuti, Umi Ajiboye, Ajalaja Lingo Akim Alimi, Asisi Jadwadi, that my son that did in the OEC the other time. They are in Russia. Yeah. So, that was many way people back. Like yeah, that's way back. And he's now a big man, as you people told me. Yeah, he's now a big man. You've seen him there. A lot of people there. Me, myself, I'm, I'm going to be there. Nekola uh, Tuji is going to be there. A lot of people. But when you watch it, I know for sure you will call your husband. If you are the only uh, madam, it's only madam that is inside. When you watch it, you will keep it to your husband. You make sure you watch it when you call her. I know that. All right. I'm sure the viewers at home will be anticipating this thing called the set back. But sir, like in how many minutes set up? But like how many in how many months will this film be ready? By the grace of God, before before mid of this new month, which is May, before mid of this month, uh, May, it will be ready by the grace of God. Urging everybody out there to please go out and get a copy of this production called the set off. The set off. The send off. Please let everybody try and indulge in this movie. You're really gonna learn a lot from it. Okay, sir. Please, um, we wouldn't want to keep much of your time because you know you're very busy. I'm so a very busy producer. You have Odulade backstage. We're still coming to Odulade. So, all right, sir. We'd like you to just give a brief introduction for yourself. Yeah. Hello, my viewers at home. My name is Wahid Ijadulade, popularly known as Dimeji. Yeah, I'm a film producer, film director, and actor. Thank you. Love you all. Yeah, so we are the after shoot set with Mr. Oduladi Adekola of a movie called Send Off. Right. Mr. Oduladi Adekola, how... I mean, how do you see the storyline of this movie, Send Off? How do you find it? Uh, to be sincere, it's a wonderful one. And you can't expect anything less than that. From that legend. I mean, I like you, YD, It's so wonderful from then. Since then, that we've been in the industry that we're very, very young. Oh, he's a wonderful producer, a fantastic director. He's just there as an entertainer. So, it's another powerful one coming out from the stable of I like you, YD, Same thing. Your head appears to be past. That's just the wrong perspective. So we are still back on Tebu's, Tebu Schools TV and um, I still have with me here the most prestigious Mr. Adeladi Adekola. Sir, so far so good. I mean, what's your what's your role? What's your lead role in this particular movie? What role are you playing? I'm playing a husband to one fantastic actor also. It's a pretty lady. Okay. It's out to her very well. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So you watch out for her. So I'm not coming at this. But I, I can assure you. 
very She's very doing good. Yeah, she's doing good. Yeah. Okay. Um, you know, the major thing about this concept is that you just have to stay with your home. Okay. If you know you love your husband, you love your wife, stay with your husband. Stay with your wife. You might think you want to try one or other thing behind your relationship. He might bounce back. So that's the major thing about this concept. That if you know you are, you are, you are, you are, you are, you are sincere with your relationship, you stay with it. All right, sir. From what we heard from the pro, uh, our producer of the particular set, Mr. Wahid Ejwade, he, 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 he said it the other time that um, they, he was trying to drop the story that a man was trying to eat a lady for the very last time before they had their relationship cut off. And that was when the lady died. Isn't it, sir? That, that was what exactly. the story was like, sir. But, sir, now I, I want to know. I mean, like, most guys believe that. Ladies, it doesn't really matter how many wives you have. At all, you tend to keep homes like this. When you have your home and you're still looking far from the storyline of this film, you're still looking in getting one particular person. For the last time, we got job. Let's just clean him out. Let's just clean him out. I mean, what? How do you get to interpret that? Uh, this is what I do every day, and this is what I love doing. So, um, to interpret script. Um, like I said, what you have been doing for long, definitely you will know how to be best on my team. So, um, it's another fantastic story that I said that they have. If you're trying to, to do something else, aside of the relationship, it might be somehow not easy enough. Like what happened to Adeyemi on the set. And that is exactly what we're trying to do. And you're playing what the role of Adeyemi on the set. the role of Adeyemi. Like set. what the producers want. It is very, it is a very bad thing for you to do extramarital affair outside your relationship. It is totally wrong for you to have an extramarital mm -hmm. affair when you have your own wife. At home from Mr. Odulade Adikola. I'm a much of my character set. I'm an actor, a producer, and a filmmaker. Probably still the best. It's entertaining. It's educating. There's a TV you gotta enjoy. You know, we have a lot of TV these days. But very, very few of them are educating and entertaining. And one of them is Pebbles TV. Don't stop it there. Watch it. My viewers at home always watch Pebble TV. Stay focused. Stay there. Don't go. Don't touch it. Pebble TV. Mm. Oh, that you. Oh, don't.